another trip down memory lane for some of us. Tiny! Tiny computer! Let's have a look, shall we? Came in this week. Welcome to another video from Jurassic Park. This week, had a tiny computer with the manual. With the manual. Thank you for buying a tiny computer. Windows 98, not second edition, doesn't look like. And the manual for that. Here it is. Tiny. I had a tiny computer. Got a Pentium 3 sticker on it. Let's have a look inside. Let's have a look inside, shall we? Now, we've been absolutely crazy busy this week. It's been difficult to get any um, video out, which is why last week's was a bit short. So I apologise for that. This is going to be equally short, probably. We've had, we've had, we've been on laptop building for the past week, and we've built 17 laptops, and they're all out for sale now. Because um, we've had uh, a reasonable donation come in. So nothing on that side, as usual. So what have we got here? It is a Pentium 3. It's looking more like a modern computer than that 486 we had last time. It is a, what is it? It's a model T1440 Bravo X-Ray Mic. Don't know what year it's from. Oh, let's have a close up, shall we? There we are, very clean. Very clean PC. No dust in this at all. The um, drive's missing. There's the chip, Pentium 3 chip. Don't make them like that anymore. Uh, and this is an ATI 3D, ATI 3D card. And a modem card, looks like. Or Ethernet card. Look at these back connectors. Let's take a trip back in time. Here we are, look. I presume these are USB 1. We've got two data ports, parallel printer port, a joystick port. What are these? Speaker, line in, mic. Seeing as this is in quite a good condition, do you know what? Let's fire it up. Fire it up, see what happens. Yeah? Let's get it on the bench. All right, so <clears throat> I've got it on the test bench. Um, the caps look okay, there's nothing swollen in there. So it looks all right and it's nice and clean. So. Unlike that 486, which had a whole lot of rust on the back, I'm going to give this one a risk. Uh, I plugged in a PS2 keyboard and mouse. Got it plugged into our big Dell monitor. Now, I've done a bit of a pimp on this monitor because it was getting hot. So, what we've done is, on the back, on the back of the monitor, oh, let's get that out. Um, I've. Uh, <laughs> I put a um, pushing fan on there, and that's pulling on the top to keep this top edge co cooler because that's where the power supply is and it gets very hot. So we've got it wired to a um, fan controller here. So on. There we are. That's running. Little bit of a mod there. Keep that, <laughs> keep that a bit cooler. How about that then, eh? Things we have to do in Project Reboots. Right, here it is. On the deck, all plugged in. 
going to hit the power button. Let's turn it on. Oh, yeah, all right, so far. Right, stand clear. What's making a noise? Oh dear. Oh look, the fan's not moving round. The fan's not moving on the power supply. I'm going to shut that down, I think. Could be clogged up with dust, couldn't it? Is it going round? Well, that is running now. That's spinning okay. All right. That's spinning all right. Oh, what's that noise? What on earth is that noise? That's the fan on the chip. It's the fan on the chip making that noise. Yeah, I think that's the fan on the chip. Oh! That is... Oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> oh, we got something on screen. What we got? Pentium 3, 450. With, um... Two... Two gigs of RAM? Surely not. Press F1 to run setup. F1. Sorry about the handshake on this. We broke the tripod last week. Sorry, I broke the tripod last week. Fell over and the top snapped off. So we're tripodless. Ah. Right. What are we looking at, Nigel? Not a lot. Advanced. What are we looking at, Nigel? Not a lot. Pentium 3, yes, 450, there we are. Well, it is what it is. Well, oh, that's better. Right, let's turn the monitor fans off. That's better, isn't it? So, if you, like me, had a tiny computer back in the day, I don't know when that would have been, a long time ago, 20 years maybe, not sure, um, they, were, they were good computers and I tell you what, I've been looking at their manual here and they really went to town on providing really good information about all sorts of things, your data, the internet, the gallant TV tuner, tiny bulletin board, the Cheyenne, Cheyenne Bitware, don't know what that is, God, anyway it goes on and on, there's a lot of stuff in there, you don't get those these days, is that good or bad, I don't know, anyway that's another quick video, if you want to buy a tiny computer come to Project Reboot, we got one, if you've liked this leave some comments in the section below, Give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, we'd appreciate your support. Um, for
For this and other upcoming voyage into Jurassic Park, stay tuned. See you next time.